Hi guys, so I'm just doing a very quick impromptu read um, just for whoever needs to hear the messages the most. Uh, this read is not zodiac dependent, it's not gender specific, it's just a really quick overall reading basically for whoever needs to hear the messages the most. So if you're resonating with the title then the chances are quite high that this, this is the read that you need to hear right now. Okay, so please provide clear messages and guidance for those who need to hear the messages the most. So whoever needs to hear the message, please. Okay, so we've got the Knight of Cups and that is Piscean energy. So some of you could be Pisces, you could have Pisces in your chart or you're dealing with someone who is a Pisces. This is the card of um, kindness, sweetness, honesty. It's basically an honest conversation or um, an honest show of emotions. It's a romantic invitation, basically. Okay. So whoever needs to hear it, please. Right, your next card out is the Fool. I'm seeing here that somebody has um, not accepted some kind of romantic offering and instead is heading off in a brand new direction. Five of Coins, um, it's Taurus energy. That pertains to the lack mentality, feeling that you're not having enough or feeling that you've been ghosted. Um, I'm seeing here that for some of you, this is actually... Um, this is you. You are wanting honesty from the individual that you've been dealing with and they were never forthcoming with their honesty. Uh, some of you were even ghosted by this particular individual as well. Um, so you took off in a brand new direction, in the complete opposite direction from the individual that you've been dealing with. <clears throat> and yeah, I'm not seeing that you're going to be looking at this particular offer. Thank you. Right, so we've got the Empress. This this can indicate divine feminine energies. Uh, so some of you watching are resonating with being divine feminines or you're dealing with the divine feminine energy. Um, I'm feeling for the most part that this is actually divine feminines that have picked up on this reading and it is you that felt that you were ghosted by this individual and you decided to take your energies elsewhere um, focusing on yourself as well with the Empress energies focusing on your own future your own abundance and your own um, your own growth okay Nine of Cups, that is Piscean energy, that pertains to wishes fulfilled. Um, so yeah, this here is a divine feminine energies who is currently fulfilling their own wishes. They're, they're charging ahead in their own direction and taking care of the things that they need to take care of. Ten of Cups, um, it's more Pisces energy and th this is indicating that someone here is basically they're, they're focusing on their family as well and they're trying to inject some kind of brand new energies into their family situation. Ten of Swords and um, that's Gemini energy, a painful ending. Um, can indicate the need to get something off your chest as well but there's someone here feels betrayed and um, deceived also ok 
Okay, Page of Coins, Earth Energy and the Eight of Swords. It's more Gemini. Um, is showing me here that some of you could be hanging around and waiting, maybe expecting an apology from the individual that you've been dealing with. It's showing me here um, that basically you, you cannot put your own healing on hold in the hope for an apology that might not never come here from this particular individual. Um, some of you have kind of backtracked a little bit with your progression. There's an energies here as well of a missed opportunity and that it's not coming from you it's coming from the individual that, that you've been dealing with there, there's some kind of um it's almost like this individual is kicking themselves because there, there is definitely a missed opportunity here that there is definitely a divine feminine energy who has been um they've been really put through it by this individual and um, they've been betrayed backstabbed somehow let down um, while this individual is kicking themselves for their behaviors i'm still not seeing that you're going to be receiving this apology that um it is due but it isn't coming and your blockages death, uh, scorpion energy, change and transformation. So that, that's a blockage here. Um, and hidden under there, five of wands. as Leo energy, conflict, competition, pu uh, push-pull energies, unnecessary. And seven of cups, uh, scorpion energy, illusion, choices, confusion, daydreaming. Okay, so there's the need here for somebody to try and remain realistic. Um, the individual that you've been dealing with, they are fully aware that they need to change. Uh, they, they need to change the way that they do things because it's just really not appropriate. Um, at some point you bent over backwards to help this individual and it was taken for granted. They assumed that you would always be there. They never expected you to sort of um, basically put a stop to to whatever it was that they were doing to you um for for some divine feminines the ghosting was actually done by you uh, you turned your back on this individual because you felt that they were taking you in a direction that you didn't want to go in uh, so so you turned your back on that you're focusing on your needs your wants your growth your prosperity you're focusing on your your family as well here for some of you um, you're focusing on fulfilling your own wishes here instead of kind of pitting all of your eggs in one basket, which is the individual that you've been dealing with. It's kind of like you, you, you're reclaiming your energies here back from this person and you're investing them back into yourselves um, so that you can start to, to prosper in your own life here um, that there is still this energies of perhaps you brought this upon yourself perhaps there was something that you did to this individual or something that you said to this individual to somehow deserve um, the, the, their betrayal towards you um, it's showing me here that it's time for you to stop that negative self-thinking and to stop blaming yourself. Uh, you need to reevaluate your options here and to remain realistic. Um, that there was something about this individual, that there was some kind of... Um, it was like an act, a show, a mask. It was like they... They showed you a, a side of themselves that was dishonest, it was not truthful and it's like you're needing to see past the illusions that this individual had cast. Um, sort of really remain realistic, definitely. And to stop holding out for an apology that might not never come that that is part of your change and transformation there's a warning here that you might be dragged into an unnecessary argument with this individual um try to avoid co further conflict with this person 
four of cups yeah because it's just going to keep you um stuck basically reject anything that looks too good to be true four of cups seven of cups not all that glitters is actually gold and this individual um that they were putting on a show basically you are heading ace of coins for a brand new beginning a brand new start you're heading towards something that you can actually grow upon it, it is something that is real and it, it's something that is going to set you up for life as well and two of coins under there the need to rebalance readjust and eight of coins yeah try try to um remain focused on your current path that path where you redirected yourself away from this individual they're, they're asking you here to stay focused on that hmm. further clarity please for this read okay Right, so wedding rings and cheers, uh, union, wedding, married, soul connection, eternal love, everlasting promise, new beginnings, anniversaries, milestones, dates, celebration, meeting new people and happiness. So I'm seeing here that for some of you, you were quite possibly married to this individual. Uh, for others of you, you were considering. So there was like an engagement here and then it's like they betrayed you somehow um that there is definitely some kind of soul contract here between you and this individual i'm feeling for the most part that this individual has served as a catalyst um to your ascension somehow and you're heading towards a brand new beginnings and your happiness so anything else for this reading please okay secrecy and affair right so for some of you this individual the betrayal does pertain to them cheating on you <clears throat> and you're kind of holding out for this apology that will never come right uh, hiding something, use discretion, surprise, collaborate, protecting, denying and risk. Some of you, this individual is denying having done this, even though the evidence is stacked up against them, they're, they're still trying to deny it. Um, keep your cards close to your chest here because someone is dealing with an individual who is not very pleasant sword in the rose clarity truth revelation solidarity force honor protection and power protect your own energies um, from this individual the this has been quite a revelation here about um about your own strength about your own resolve it's like this situation has really catapulted you into quite a dark time and you've you've realized your worth um almost because of this it's like you know that, that you're better than than the way that this individual has trapped you and under there, the Grim Reaper, the relationship's over, no second chances, grow and transform your life. So yeah, the focus very much needs to be here on you. And um, any, for, for some of you, there, there was, you, you were definitely playing with the idea on giving this particular individual another chance. For some of you, you were definitely. Um, the 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 advice that is here in this particular read is very much against that because you'll end up with more of the same if you if you go back to that situation 
For those where this particular reading is resonating, it's showing here that uh, you've been reluctant to begin a brand new journey with the Ace of Coins because that was showing up in your blockage. There, there's an energies here of guilt that that you're trying to overcome, feeling guilty for wanting to um, improve your current situation, uh, a guilt for wanting to to start again, basically. Um, the overall advice here that's coming through for you is to not keep yourself small and to, to really investigate the opportunities that have opened up for you and to step forward uh, confidently into your brand new beginning and to confidently reject those who do not see your worth and your value. So yeah, I just hope that that has um, helped somebody out, um, obviously if it has resonated for you. I wouldn't like to think that that has resonated for very many people because that's quite a difficult energies. Um, but nonetheless, whoever it's resonated for, I just really hope that that has helped you out um, and to sort of given you the confidence to, to keep moving forward, basically away from whoever that is that you've been dealing with. OK, so, yeah, um, hope you have a lovely week and please do stay safe out there as well. OK, bye.